Hi everyone, my name is Atik. Atik is now working with us in registry administration, who was a student with us and has now come back as a staff member at AIS. Tell us a little bit about your journey um, at AIS and what you've been doing since you graduated. I was a student at AIS back in 2017, studied uh, hospitality management in level 7. Well, while I was uh, studying, I had the opportunity to work for uh, Hilton Hotels as a part-time. And the good thing was what I was learning, mm -hmm. theoretically, and then I can apply in the real world. And once I graduated, I got uh, a full-time offer from Hilton Hotels. What made you decide to transition from your career in hospitality to coming back to work at AIS? I always wanted to work for the education sector, mm -hmm. uh, for, uh, especially in the student service sector. Mm -hmm. There is no better place than working at the place where you studied. And uh, when I saw the advertisement for this role uh, in AIS website, mm -hmm. I didn't even hesitate for a second to apply and then I just applied and came for the interview and now I'm here. Okay, yeah. Atik, I yeah. have got a little bit of a video to show you Oh wow. Uh, that we found from a few years ago, so mm -hmm. take a look at this. What is your name? My name is Mohammed Atik Ullah, uh, you can call me Atik and currently I'm studying uh, level 7 hospitality management and this is my second last semester. Yeah, I would say like, uh, you know, one good thing about AI is, is like, you know, they it's an encouragement for us because we, uh, after studying like semester by semester, we are entitled to get this scholarship and to get that, uh, we have to work hard. And I would like to thank to all my lecturers, you know, uh, they are really helpful uh, because AIS, they focus individually, each person, person to person, so which is really good. And I really appreciate each and every teacher's, you know, assistance. They really help us. Uh -huh. <laughs> Like, so how do you feel seeing that video of yourself six years ago? It's a bit a surprise that AI still have this video. It brings a lot of memories. Yeah. Mm, I can see yeah. it makes you feel a bit emotional, <laughs> seeing your old friends in there. Yeah, I mean, my and, and some of are still my good friends. Yeah. Yeah, we're still in touch. Do you remember what you were doing in that video? I was receiving the Academic Achievement uh, Award. I didn't even know that I was uh, qualified uh, for that uh, award, to be honest. But then when I got an email, from the registry team that, hey, Atik, congratulations, you are selected for the Academic Achievement Award. And I was like, wow, oh. It's very challenging to get into hotels like Hilton. Yeah. And when you do not have any experience. So I remember when I got the Academic Achievement Award, I put that on my CV, mm -hmm. and I put reference as my lecturers. And then I could speak about that, uh, refer uh, about the Academic Achievement Award. And uh, when the, the hiring team back in Hilton, they were really uh, you know, excited. What would be the things that you would say to current AIS students or someone considering to come and study at AIS? Always be, instead of being reactive, mm -hmm. be proactive. Mm -hmm. If you have any queries or questions and definitely you will get guidance from the lecturers. That I, from my own personal experience, I did receive a lot of uh, support and guidance from the staff and also from the uh, lecturers. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for being with us, Atik. I'm sure um, some of your advice to our, our current and future students will be taken on board. It's great to be back here as an employee after six years. I can see a lot of familiar lecturers, a lot of familiar staff members still working. Great work-life balance at AIS. I'm enjoying it. Awesome. Yeah. Thank well, you. we're happy to have you. Thanks.